Hi friends, uh, my name is Mohammad Kashif and I'm your trainer. I have 17 plus years of experience in the field of substations, potential systems, and uh, uh, this uh, about this training that I will introduce you is about circuits basics. So this training will be very unique in the sense that uh, we'll try to understand different concepts. By example, I will try to uh, relate uh, examples with the real field practical experiences so that you will be able to understand these concepts and it will be really uh, will be a really a fun for you to understand each and everything so let's go through the course briefly we will start with Ohm's law and I will be explaining you Ohm's law which is simple as V is equal to IR but I will be further explaining resistance uh, voltage I will explain how you can calculate current, uh, what is the difference between voltage drop, and what is the potential difference, what is the source and load voltages. So um, we will discuss the concept of source voltages and load voltages. We will discuss the concept of source impedance and I will give you a practical example that how source impedance basically affect the system. Then we will discuss about line impedance and we have a brief discussion about the load impedance in fact uh, source impedance has also effect on basically the um, voltage drops and also the line impedance has effect on the voltage drop at the end you need to get the voltage at the source which should be stable enough then we will discuss the concept of voltage drop across the line voltage drop across the source impedance voltage drop across the load impedance we will discuss about uh, I call all losses, I call power losses. We'll discuss about percentage voltage drop and how to calculate it and we'll um, show I will show you an example and how it's working. We will be discussing in this training about uh, reference or neural voltages. What is the concept of potential difference? What will happen if neutral voltage rise? Neutral or ground voltage are uh, normally considered at zero, but there are some cases where the neutral voltage can rise, and we will discuss some examples, uh, very simple examples. Further, we will discuss the concept of constant voltage source and constant current source. We all have uh, um, study in, in our universities and in colleges these concepts, but I will try to explain you in a way that. You will be you never forget it and it will be really a fun and which is a good high or low source impedance what are merits and demerits of high and low source impedances okay the, uh, this is my some slides um, which is explaining the ohm's law and i will be explaining you ohm's law by an, an graph basically i and v both are proportional Further, we will I will show you the Ohm's law formula. We will proceed with Ohm's law applications. How to how do we establish the current voltage relationship using Ohm's law? Then we can define the formula and define the rules. We have resistance formula, which is basically equal to resistivity into length divided by an area. Which in this way you can calculate the total resistance. We have resistance in series, example of resistance in series, and we we'll calculate this one. And I will show you how it works. It's very simple. Further, we will take uh, low laws of series circuit. That is, individual resistance add up to the total circuit. Current through the circuit is the same at every point. Individual voltages throughout the circuit add up to the total voltages. Then we have another case of resistance in parallel. So there are many different ways to organize a parallel circuit. In the practical world, most of the wiring is done in parallel. So that the voltage to any point of the network is the same as the voltage applied to any other part of it. We will discuss parallel circuits, laws of parallel circuits, how to add resistance in parallel, voltage, what happened in the voltages to in parallel circuit 
how to add currents and we will discuss a little bit about KCL Kirchhoff's current law here we will solve some examples of questions and this is will be the end of our training here you can see I will focus on these topics. Uh, I will be explaining these topics like voltage drop, percentage voltage drop, losses, uh, the concept of source and load impedances, the concept of current and voltage sources. I will, will be delivering in, 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 in a coral draw, uh, smooth draw software and I will be explaining you this thing in, in a way that I have never been told you before. So I hope that you will enjoy my training and I really encourage to enroll this training. Thank you very much.